fellow roguish renegades. I'm your host, Amanda McKnight, and this is my home co-host, Lola. And we'll be guiding you through this April recap, where we get you up to date on anything that you may have missed happening here at Renegade this month. You can find links for everything mentioned in this video in the video description. And be sure to subscribe and ring that bell if you haven't already to make sure that you don't miss out on all our resplendent monthly Renegade news in regards to new games and other updates. Let's take a look at some of the new games and expansions available for pre-order this month. Viscounts of the West Kingdom has been announced. This third and final game in the West Kingdom trilogy pits players against one another as Viscounts during a time when the king's reign was in decline, circa 1980 AD, vying for influence as the certainty of our future's prosperity as well as that of the kingdoms becomes unstable. Influence comes in the form of victory points, which can be accrued through completing tasks such as acquiring acquiring land deeds, constructing buildings, writing manuscripts, working in the castle, and traveling to various areas of society. It is also important that you find the right townsfolk to help you minimize your efforts along the way, as the kingdom presses towards poverty, prosperity, or potentially both, which signals the end of the game. And if you are a huge fan of the games set in the West Kingdom, including Architects, Paladins, and the newest Viscounts, you might also want to check out this newly announced title, The West Kingdom Tome Saga. Connect all three games together using this expansion to build your kingdom, defend its borders, and increase your influence throughout the land. In the campaign mode, players compete to collect the most tomes and earn their own place in the annals of history. Alternatively, players can also band together to take on the Overlord in the separate cooperative modes for each title within the West Kingdom trilogy. Every copy of the West Kingdom Tome Saga also includes promos for the three West Kingdom titles. Woo! Fans of all things Raiders of the North Sea can also now pre-order the new Raiders of the North Sea Collector's Box, designed to hold the Raiders of the North Sea base game as well as the Hall of Heroes and Fields of Fame expansions. The box also features new cover art from the Maiko, Mahaljo Dimtrevesky, which is also featured on the 200 special card sleeves that is included with the collector's box, enough for all townsfolk cards. In addition, all pre-orders will also get a set of the Maiko promo cards. We have a new game that has also been just announced, Athenium Mystic Library. Designed for 2-5 to five players ages 10 and up, players in this game will work to prepare last minute for their magic exam tomorrow, which none of them have studied for. Oh no! Use magic to tap your wand on stacks of books to learn subjects instantly, but be sure to organize the shelves as you go. And keep an eye on your academic peers, as every action you take will give them one in this competitive group study session. Gameplay takes 30-45 to 45 minutes, with the player who has the most beautifully decorated and organized shelf of books at the end being declared the winner. If you are a big fan of the Magical School theme, then we also have another announcement to excite and inspire you. Kids on Brooms is a new RPG that is narrative first, heavily storytelling focused, and light on the rules, which uses the E Knight award winning Kids on Bikes framework. You and your friends can now play in the collaborative RPG as students attending the same magical academy filled with mystery, danger, and thrilling adventure. You'll get to battle mythical beasts and deal with strict professors balancing your everyday schoolwork where you learn potions, broom flying, and spells with everyday adventure. Uncover secrets surrounding your school and its staff and students with your friends in this RPG designed for 2-6 to six players ages 8 and up. Found within the pages of the Magical Kids on Brooms RPG 100 page full color book. If you pre-order you'll get a digital PDF of the game sent your way when the game Mirrors release in August. And if Power Rangers Heroes of the Grid is more your speed, or is additionally your speed, you can now pre-order the first Allies pack for the game, which includes some of your favorite and legendary Power Rangers allies from across time and space. This set includes Ninjor, Phantom Ranger, Shadow Ranger, Magna Defender, and Zeo Gold Ranger. The Bargain Quest Sunk Cost Expansion is now available for pre-order. Bargain Quest is a game of adventure and capitalism for 2-6 to six players, where you and your friends take on the role of shopkeepers aiming to keep your stores stocked to supply the heroes of your RPG town, which is plagued by monsters. This expansion introduces a variety of nautical heroes, monsters, and items for your shops, as well as the brand new Supply Ships game mode. Sunk Cost brings you and your shop to the seven seas, but try not to fall 
all over board. Pre-order now to get a chance at getting your hands on an exclusive new shop board, The Secret Cave. But be quick as these are limited, first come, first served. This month we have a ton of fantastic Renegade titles on Worldwide Play Day, including The Fox in the Forest, Clank, Arboretum, Bargain Quest, and Raiders of the North Sea. If you missed out, be sure to stay tuned as we will be hosting even more Worldwide Play Day events next month. We also relaunched the Renegade Society radio show. Each episode features an interview, including designers like Jonathan Ying and board game personalities like Rodney Smith. You can watch it live on Fridays, watch the VODs on YouTube, or download the interview in podcast form. We have even more free content this month with our Free Content Friday. This month, it includes a free print and play of Wonderland to keep yourself entertained while you stay in. There is also a new Power Rangers Heroes of the Grid scenario featuring both Goldar and Mega Goldar. We also have even more RPG goodness coming your way in the form of Seed of Birkin for Overlight, as well as a free quick start bundle for the game with an introductory adventure, pre-generated characters, and chroma descriptions. A new Icarus setting suggestion for you to play with, and new adventures for the teens in space and Outbreak Undead RPGs. Be sure to still check in with us on Twitch as we are still streaming every Monday, Tuesday, and Thursday. For more ways to stay connected and up to date with all things Renegade, be sure to follow us on social media, sign up to the Renegade newsletter, and subscribe to us on YouTube and Twitch. Thank you so much for watching and for staying up to date with us. Stay safe out there, and as always, remember to play your game.